check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. South Central LA came across this Jeep right here on Facebook Marketplace and the uh, lady was kind enough to let us come see it so let's check it out they have it listed as a 42 wheelies Got a cab over. Old school, looks like it's like India style. Let's go this way. Spotlights. It's for sale and I'll put the link on the, at the bottom. They got this hood mount. Ow! <laughs> it's got a winch. It's got the original hubs on there. Looks like they raised the fender here. Cut some off of here. Portholes. Tight spot right here. Got a lot of gadgets here. Spotlight. What are these things? Oh my goodness. The lights. The key's still in it. The shag carpet up top. I'm not sure what all the stuff is. I'm seeing it as you're seeing it. <laughs> the lady says I got five minutes. We're gonna make this happen. It's like a T90. Yep. T90 overdrive. And we got uh, probably a Dana 18 behind it. Check out that dash. She says it's a 42, but there's no data plates up here. I'll open the hood right now and check this thing out. It's got a watch. Is that an altimeter over here? Yeah. Alt gauge, clocks. Old school. Radios. Oh, this guy loved his gadgets, whoever he was. <laughs> A nice heater. Some more switches and gauges. Amp gauge. Check out that dash right there. Up top here. Like their horns, maybe, huh? It's got CB, red light, some sort of blue. It's got CB up there. Wow, pretty slick. Oh, a lot of. These look like one of those uh, jeepneys from the Philippines when I was there in the military. This kind of reminds me of. Pretty cool. Cool seats. Let's get around this look of the hood. All right, lift it up, son. Lift this up. Watch out, that thing will bite you. <laughs> All right. Whoa, it's a heavy hood. All right, hold it, huh? 
We got horns. I guess that's probably to some of the switches in, in the inside. It's like a small box trailer. Alternator. Power steering. I think it moves. It's not moving though. A lot of stuff going on. He's got air compressor, another horn. He liked his horns. Looks like he cut out the hood to make room for his air, his air cleaner. Running original radiator. I don't know what kind of California car. Steering box. I'm not sure what kind of. Put it in the comments down below what kind of winch that is. Oh, we got. Oh, he's got doubles. Yeah, you shut it, son. <laughs> I'd buy it just for that. <laughs> Under here, it's like you put down in some. Yeah, to get under there. He's got double action coilovers, looks like. Very impressive. That's probably stock front end 25. Yeah, it says it right there. 25. Yeah. Warren Overdrive, Dana 18, Dana 44 to the back. He's got put coils on there too. The rear end. Drum brakes all the way around. Looks like they're bigger. So you get the 11 inch. It's drums. Let's take a look at the back. Well, that's pretty cool. Look at that Willie sign back there. It's hard to get over there. I got some bob wire here. That's sick. Smooth. It's like it last on the road it was in 1999. Some air vents. Down here, I thought these open, but maybe he made a storage compartment, but it's not there. He rounded these fenders, added some some good stuff. Spotlights, look at M38A1 windshield. Another spotlight, spotlight. Got these cool F-250 lights up here. Check out these knobs. I don't know if you can see it. Some sort of ornate, they're metal. Pretty cool. The hanging pedals. The floor. Looks like he extended the back end back there. A couple feet, maybe two feet.
Yeah, this definitely looks like a jeepney. Somebody must have, somebody must have brought it home from Manila. Freaking cool. Put some horns down there. bigger and I'll put the the link to the uh, Facebook marketplace down below if you want to check it out it's down here in South Central LA